So, Halloween is in two days and I still don't have a pumpkin. And since one of my resolutions was to go to a pumpkin patch and get a pumpkin, I'm trying to go to a pumpkin patch to get a pumpkin. Here's some of the issues involved. I can't find a pumpkin patch where I thought it was. I don't think I can't find it. I just want some fall. I just want a little gold shirt. They're out of pumpkins. I asked Suri to find me a pumpkin. I asked Suri to find me a pumpkin patch. So we'll see where she's taking me. Also, it's a beautiful day. Brought me here. I guess this counts. Is this like a California pumpkin patch? Does this count? Because like, there's can be choosers. I don't want them all. So like, do you choose an ugly one? Do you choose by its color? Like how does one choose a pumpkin? Also, it's right by it's right by a winery. So I'm just saying. So I ended up with these, big and small. I figured the small I can have like in my living room, make it all ballsy, and I'll put the big one outside, and then I'll probably carve the big one. So pretty good. It was a little weird going there with no kids, and I'm just wandering around looking at pumpkins by myself. But I do feel super ballsy, and like it is fall, so I think mission accomplished. I have a confession to make. I can't exactly remember what my three fall resolutions are, so I'm gonna have to go watch that video again. I know one of them is to watch, have a day of watching movies, because I've been super excited about it, and I think I'm gonna do that tomorrow. But, the third one, I vacillated. I think it's carve a pumpkin, but there might be something else faulty. I've also been really excited to read, so I've been carrying my book around everywhere. I have not cracked it open yet, but carrying around means I'm prepared. If I feel super fallsy, I can just read it. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Christina Goes and Finds a Pumpkin in the Forest. There, there will not be a Christina Goes and Finds a Christmas Tree in the Forest episode coming up, though, I'm afraid. That is just... That's too far. That's a little too much joy. But I'm gonna embrace fall and not look ahead to Christmas even though I'm super excited for Christmas. And I'm gonna go home and put on a movie and light a candle and look at my pumpkin. Okay, bye.